since you became a black woman, have you experienced racism? On, uh, also, not really racism, also in, on the streets, um, a lot of people think um, I'm neutral, also, also they know me from television and social media and say hello, I want to have a selfie or an autograph, or they don't know me and, and they know I'm friendly, also they um, really get fast in, in, in contact and speak about them, also, uh, also in, on um, really racism on the street, I hadn't, thanks a lot, uh, thanks um, no. In um, social media, I got a lot of criticism, but with criticism, you also can learn. Because also when, when I, for example, when in March 2017, I stopped working with the white makeup. And then, um, <laughs> for example, the, 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 it sounds like hate, but they teach me. It was a little bit rude, but also in, in course of time, I also um, um, make my makeup matching and also Step by step, I'm learning. It is also, uh, it, yeah, the, the word blackface is coming from, for example, in Cologne, there is a lot of carnival, but they don't want to uh, hate the black people. They we, we have blackface even here in Switzerland, yes. Yeah, also, they, also no, the, the, the one piece was, um, they sent me also a picture of um, carnival people having a black um, makeup and um, really um, bad, Outfits that should look like an African person and making party, but they don't want to uh, be aggressive to the people itself. They only want to have a party with alcohol and party. That was only um, um, they also had could take an, an, um, um, another outfit like a matro or like a um, sailor or something else. They don't they didn't think about what they having. Uh, how they only want to have a um, costume. Yeah, but. But I uh, know in uh, America and in the US, if they go with uh, black makeup, they want to hurt. I know. There's the, there's yeah, the but you know, sometimes you do things and you don't think about it and you end up really hurting a culture. This is exactly the problem. This is really white privilege. The ability to be able to choose to do what you want. When I wake up in the morning, I cannot unzip my, 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 my skin and say, I don't know. I'm not a, 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 a white woman. Yeah. But you, you had, don't you, need to. I, you had, because you had the strong. ability to yeah. choose. No, wait. You had the ability to choose. Do I want to be white or do I want to be black? I no, don't have no, this no, no, ability. No, no. I don't have this ability. I'm stuck in this skin. And because of this skin, a lot of people are really suffering. You have the ability. You had the ability. You chose to be black. But what we are saying is a lot of cultural appropriation happens. Kim Kardashian does it. Yeah, um, Arena Glande does it. I couldn't get any of those two. You are the nearest I could get to actually try and explain to us what the hell. Why are you people only taking the things you like about the black culture and leaving the heart behind? We wouldn't mind if you take everything. You experience racism. You have to experience all those things if you really want to be black. It's not just a trophy to put on color and, and walk around because you have the privilege. You're a white woman. You can do what you want. You will always be white. Everybody knows that. Everybody no, no. Knows how you became black. The people who know you, the people who don't know that, they will meet you, they look at you, and then they want to Google. But we are suffering because of this. Don't you understand? Yeah, I understand your position. But um, you have, have to say, the media often tell stories about me that are not true.